built of stone. Lovingly this place was crafted. You see the lights, the mystic halls of ordered reality? They are the faces of the missing, the embodied truth of the lost souls. There are so many of them. Still, you can see them. 
They are like pathetic charades, some with good intentions, and you can't fault them that. But the majority of them are just a hoax. Needless to say, I don't like it here. You could have stayed free and lived a comfortable life, but you couldn't settle a disquiet that haunts people like you. Care to join me in my work? You look like you could use a few moments of quiet reflection. This warped old rod? I can't imagine why you'd have any interest in it. It's a patchwork piece, cobbled together from bits and bobs. However, I did invest many hours of my life in its construction. My hands still bear the calluses. I would part with it for a price. I couldn't have parted with it for any less, you understand. A man's handiwork is still worth something. Enjoy the peace, and good day. Goodbye, then. seem so strange. I'm sure there are many people who in their youth had a similar experience, but of course I am leaving something out. I mentioned the unrest in my soul. I know it intimately. When I was young, I was visited by something unlike anything else of this world. It was an ephemeral, ghostly thing. I called it a divine spirit, for I had no better word to describe it. This thing was not fey, but possessed a timelessness like one. It glowed with an aura of magic about it, but I was not afraid, for a serene peace was born on the countenance of this divine spirit. Oh. 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 